Hey y'all. Okay, so um, this is going to be kit B. Um, and I'm gonna do a flip through of everything and show you everything that you will get. This is available on my Etsy shop and there will be a link in the description below the video. Uh, if you just click more, it should show all the information um, and give you a link uh, directly to this one. Okay, so I'm going to start with all the little stuff again. And that goes into the papers, I believe. Okay, so let's just start with like all the trinket stuff first. Um, you have this. This is a tea dyed um, glassine bag. A Prima flower. I also threw one, another one of these in there, and it's just double sided. Um, it's like a tape roller. Um, and this one also has a couple of those fabric strips. And I believe they're they're roughly 12 inches long, give or take. And then I also included one of the vintage clothespins with some uh, vintage lace. You get a Betty Crocker uh, coupon. And I believe this is a, um, I think it's a cigar wrapper. And you also get one of the vintage milk caps that goes like on the glass jars. Some tickets. A little butterfly. And it's like a hard, it's so beautiful. You get a domino. And there's a variety of vintage buttons. Like some big, some small. Make sure there's a little tiny. And then you get one of the little mini um, clothespins. A couple of the Tim Holtz uh, clips and the little tiny, like those little mini paper clips. One of the metal gears. And then you also get one of these. And this is that vintage, um, it's this stuff. It's silky ribbon, or, so, yeah, silk ribbon. So you get some of this also. And you get a piece of this uh, fabric and it's really nice. It has like a wallpaper look, but it's soft. A check, 1928, another one. And this one is also from uh, 1920s, a card, some tags, there's an alteration, and I think this was, I think they call it a shipping tag, I think is what it's called. And then the um, library uh, catalog card, and a vintage uh, phone slip thing, some saber stamps, and I believe, yeah, here's um, one of the vintage, uh, it goes out further than that, but one of the vintage saber book and some stamps. And some more of these little, this is like a little invoice, um, receipt thing, important messages. There's another ticket and flinch card. Uh, IOU card. More of the stamps. Uh, it's like a money wrap. Playing card. And I can't can't remember. These are, it was in a number thing. Um, and this is a vintage, like element, it was came like in an elementary box of different stuff from elementary school. Envelope. 
Deno pad, uh, coffee dyed uh, doily, some music paper, and let's see, some of that got mixed in. I was trying to keep this more separate, but another uh, glassine bag, and this is um, a vintage, uh, it's like a form, order form. And this is from like a, a children's coloring book. And this is the, uh, it's a page from a notary book. And it's actually from my notary book because I used to be a notary. Beautiful napkin. And you get some vintage, uh, what are these, the invoices? Yeah, let's see, one, two, three, four. You get five of this one, and I believe it's five of this one too. Two, three, four, five, yeah. So you get five and five of those. One, two, three, four. Four sheets of some tea dye paper. And the way that I do my, my tea dye paper, uh, you can print on this. It never jams up in my printer or anything like that. So you can print, if you have like printables of old documents and stuff, you can print on these and it comes out looking so real. And beautiful. This is from that uh, fine arts um, book that I have. And that's uh, vintage. Here's another uh, bag you could use like as a pocket or you could even use this as a cover for a little journal. Um, order forms. And there's a couple stapled here. These are just some vintage papers. And my um, dictionary page, recipe page. And this is from that, that vintage Spain book I had. It's about different things in Spain. And toot, children's book. And more just vintage book pages and dictionary. I believe this one was from the um, it's like a um, crossword dictionary book. There's a couple of sheets of this one. They're still connected. And this is from um, a um, 1980s Nat Geo. Uh, some vintage ledger. Notebook. Graph, some more vintage music, and this one here. Um, this is not a vintage, but I just like the image on this one. This is uh, like elementary um, writing paper. More ledger. And of course, my little bags that my husband got me to send all of this stuff in. So this is, um, this is kit B. So if you are interested in this kit, you can go to uh, my Etsy shop and that's where you will find it. Okay, that's it guys. Thank you for watching. Bye.